What's up? We are back for the part two because we had to do a flight back on this regional airliner and that is always what we love to see because, you know, this is commercial aviation channel or just aviation channel and you just love to see planes flying. And let's go ahead and we will take off and return to the first airport. This is a part two, so if you didn't see the part one, be sure to go see the part one because then you'll explain, you'll, I don't know, it'll be, the video will be in context, but if you didn't know, we are here in Turboprop Flight Simulator, the most accurate flight simulator for turboprops. And we are here in an ATR-42 flying a small route. And if you're wondering if this is a real place in the world, no, it's not. None of this takes place in a real place. It's just an imaginary little island. Not imaginary, obviously, it's in an app, but it was, it's just a made-up island. It's not, actually, it's not actually a thing, you know? That's the one thing that I don't really love about this flight sim, but... Still, the quality of the aircraft and everything, like, look at this, live cockpits and everything like that, like, that's all wonderful. As you can tell, I'm having to control the yoke and use the rudder a bit as well, like, a lot, there's been a lot of rudder input so far. Let's just climb, we'll go steep climb and then... Even out. And let's go right through there. And we are coming in for a landing, as you can see on... Oh, wow, there are a lot of airports on the map. I just realized that. All right. Or maybe that's the end. Oh, no. We're coming in for landing at that airport, I think. But don't take my word for it. Oh, no. No, we're going to miss it. Come on, okay. There we go. Oh yeah, definitely. Over there at that airport. Yep, that's the airport that we started at. Let's slow down a bit. Well, actually, just, what is that? Oh, that's the different configurations. Oh, cool. I'd rather have the big map right there. Oh my gosh, this is a weird view. This is a strange view. Yeah, alright, there we go. Wait, no, come on. There we go. And let's just come in for a nice landing. Oh, that's actually a nice little city over there. Obviously not a real city. Now let's do that and then we'll just oh. why are we already getting altitude call outs that's weird oh that's because we were just above a hill all right we're almost at like a hundred so 100 knots so I'm just can increase the throttle a bit 500 is it like an old British guy saying this? Wouldn't it be, wouldn't, shouldn't it be like, I don't know, I don't know. It's just, ETR is a Franco-Italian manufacturer, so I would expect like a French guy, I don't know. That doesn't make sense either. Let's come in for a butter landing this time. Wait, where are the, okay. I was just about to say, where are the runway markings? That was hard, but that's fine. There we go, that's the the rest of the mission, and let's wait through another frickin' ad. 
Okay, there we go. Now we have... Oh, I... Okay. Um, let's see how much time we're at right now. You know what? That's just gonna... That's gonna conclude today. And maybe tomorrow I'll post another one of these. But... Basically, you know, leave a like if you want to see see more flight sim reviews like this. So thank you everybody for watching and be sure to like and subscribe and have a wonderful day.